Now look, without an appointment. Well, you've got a very busy morning. There's a board meeting. Come in, Don, will you? Good morning. Uh, Miss Linda. Get rid of him. Oh, who was that? A very unpleasant youth whom I sacked last night. Oh. Now, what's all this about Revage going to see Teddington? A piece of intelligence I picked up on the grapevine late last night. I did try to phone you. Yes, I was at this company dance. <laughs> oh, sorry to have to get you out of bed so early yes. this morning. You know what the old fox is up to? He's trying to spike our guns. And there's too much of a coincidence him seeing Teddington on the morning of the board meeting. Mm, that's why I thought you ought to know. Yes, I'd better do some scouting around. I can't have anybody backing out at this juncture. Yes, I've got a few things for you too. Yes, well, give me an hour to get through this lot and to make some phone calls. Oh. And I've got to arrange for that supplicant out there to be paid off. Well, what's you been up to? Well, I tell you. Pamela and I made a duty call at this affair last night. When we came out at about half past ten, we found our friend in the back of my car making love to a little bit of Frippet. In your car? At it like knives, snogging away like crazy. Oh, good Lord. Mm. So you sacked him? No. No, not immediately. I told him to get out of my car. And then, amongst other pleasant things, he called me a filthy pig and a power-drunk idiot. Then I sacked him. Oh. 